coached a uh, 4-2 loss today. Jesse pitched really well, had some big moments in the game. Harris did another home run. Just overall, your thoughts on the afternoon? It's kind of hard to pitch better than Jesse did today. It's a shame we couldn't uh, finish it for him. Um, we tried to get him all the way through to the ninth, and maybe he would have got there if we left him. But um, we thought he had done everything he could for us in this game. So, um, and obviously Harris Homer was big. Uh, we had a few other chances to tack on some more runs, but we couldn't stretch it out enough. But um, the way Jesse was going, looked like two was going to be enough today. We kind of let him down on the defensive side. Didn't really, still hasn't given up a hard hit ball today, and they got a few guys on base in the ninth. But yeah, really tough game. Result wasn't there for us, but. Um, Lynch, he's a good pitcher. He's only given up 60 base runners in 57 innings. So we knew it was going to be that type of game if we were going to win it. So it was tough to not come out on the winning end when you're two outs away. But that's how baseball goes sometimes. They out-toughed us in the end. Early in the game, it seemed like there were a lot of quick at-bats swinging up the first pitch. When later, when you guys had some success, you were going a little deeper, fouling off pitches, and just being able to take pitches, knowing that he's around the zone a lot. How did you see the at-bats change as he went about his outing? We knew he's just not going to give you anything for free. So you have two... You could either wait it out, and he can dominate by striking people out and being ahead, or you can go try and attack him. So our guys were trying to attack him. We weren't getting any results early, which led to some quick innings. But he's their guy, so he's going to go 7 eight, 9 no matter what you're <laughs> doing in the box. So that was our plan. Our guys listened. They did as good as they could in the box. Uh, we just didn't create enough opportunities or get a big two-out hit here and there to create something. But um, as the game went on, we had good at-bats and had a few rallies. But again, I mean, you score two runs, it's not going to be enough most days, but it, it almost was today. Now, Jesse, what did you see that was really working well from him? Obviously, in the third, new highest high innings pitched on the season, walked only one batter. Just what was working for him well? Uh, breaking ball that they were chasing, and he was able to flip in for strike. So he was pretty much in control of what was going on. Um, knew, yeah, he fell behind a few guys, but intentionally, guys we were trying to avoid here and there. But he was getting ground balls, balls in play. I mean, there was not one moment I looked at him out there that I thought he wasn't in full control of the game. Um, he was getting really good hitters to chase pitches out of the zone and take pitches in the zone, and that's when you know someone's really got it going on the mound. So, um, yeah, I mean, you can't ask for more out of Jesse today. One of the big hits in the game, Patrick King comes up with a two run, or sorry, a two out RBI double that extended lead to two. He seems like he's been having a lot of good at bats lately. What have you seen from him as the season's gone on? Same thing, discipline at the plate. Um, sometimes he gets a little over aggressive, and you could see it kind of in his last at bat. He chased a pitch up. But his aggression leads to some of those doubles. So it's a double-edged sword with him. But for the most part, he's up there looking to make something happen early. There's always something action early in the at-bat. So um, we have no problem with Pat does offensive side. Uh, he's done a good job for us there. Uh, looking ahead to tomorrow, game two of the series, looking to get back on track. What are the things that you need from the team to try to get the victory back home tomorrow? Yeah, we just got to show up tomorrow like today never happened, like we always ask them to do. I know it's been a tough stretch of results, but like I said, Wednesday after that game, when, when Jesse and Shu are on the mound, we like our chances, and I think that showed true today. Uh, she was coming off a really good performance in San Diego, had a tough first inning, but showed us and showed himself how he could battle through that and still get length in the game. So we're excited to get him back out, but it'd be nice if our offense could get rolling a little bit, some deeper at batch, make it a little tougher on them. Not such easy outs early in the game, but they stuck to the plan, so we'll see what we can come out with tomorrow.